Hey. Oh, wow. You look so whimsical slash beautiful. Thank you. I just bathed in the stream and then I ran through the field to drive myself. They're already on the road. I mean, why does my mother need to get to every place early? What is that? Oh, I hate when people are early. It's so vile. I mean, of course people shit in the street. You've shit in the street, right? No. Oh, you're telling me every shit you've ever taken has been on a toilet? Yes. Oh, God. You know you're impossible. Hey! It's Jessa. Yeah, I know. It's been a very long time. I, um... I... I know I can't believe I uh, am still alive either. When I was a drug addict, and you were a total enabler. That's bullshit, Susan. I told you I needed counseling, and you took me to an ayahuasca ceremony. Can I pick up your baby? No, you can't. I'm just wondering if it's maybe like a little bit threatening for babysitting. It's floor length. Sex from behind is degrading, point blank. You deserve someone who wants to look in your beautiful face, ladies. What if I want to focus on something else? What if I want to feel like I have others? This woman doesn't care about what I want. I don't like women telling other women what to do or how to do it or when to do it. Every time I have sex, it's my choice. Yeah. And when if I wanted to go on some dates, I would. But I don't because they're for lesbians. You look really gorgeous. I love you all stripped down. I've never been this miserable in my life. It's totally working. It's like my worst nightmare as a kid, you know, being the last one to be picked up from like school or some social event, and then all these adults know about like your sad home life and your irresponsible parents. I think it's only bad when the weird sub molests you. You were molested by a weird sub? Yeah, no, I don't know, maybe, probably. You still have your UTI? I'm pretty sure it's gone. You know, I heard the best way to get rid of that is to stick garlic in your pussy. Are you serious? Yeah, but I think you have to, like, put a whole clove, like, really shove it up there. I want to go in there and see what's happening so bad. Do you think it's gory? No, it just looks like me after we've eaten, like, a big Mexican dinner. Anna. No, but, like, her actual pussy, what's happening? Oh, I didn't get to see her pussy. Adam, did you see it? I didn't fucking look. That's my fucking sister. Adam, maybe you should look because it's your sister. Would you have sex with a virgin? Depends on the virgin. Me? Oh, where did you go? Oh, shit. If I had a cock, it's all I'd do. But the weirdest part about having a job is? Um, I'm, no, I'm a student. You have to be there every day, even on the days you don't feel like it. Do you not feel like it today? Today's fine. I just don't know how I'll feel tomorrow. Well, do you want to, like, call his cell phone, or...? There's no point. Do I call Petula's phone? Remember I gave my cell phone to that guy at the Mexican restaurant? <laughs> so, Jessa, why did you leave? Um, I, uh, had to go to rehab. Oh. Oh! So, you're back on the drink again. That's great! Yeah, no... Come on. I've been drinking since I was a child. It's of not course. alcohol. It was for heroin, actually. Oh. I never shot it. I only snorted it. Oh, That's important. Yeah, it's just like an ad bill. Where's Jessa? Did she not even show? No, oh, she just insists on sitting on the back of the bus for political reasons. I will text you the minute I recharge my phone. So good to meet you. You guys are the best. And it made me remember what it was like in college when you'd say, oh, meet me at the Free Palestine party. Then I find out you're over at the Israel house. I mean, this is kind of your gift. It's kind of my gift. Shoshana, I have four fucking suicide attempts under my belt. Men who just couldn't live without me. I feel like you are using being molested as an excuse. Oh, Jessa, Jessa. I don't know what else to say. You're already on mail ban. Yeah, I know. This sign makes it pretty clear. I don't want you to be mad at me. I would hate if you hated me. Okay, whatever. And I'm sorry for your uncle fucking you. You are full of shit, and I know exactly what you're doing, and I'm not gonna be a pawn in your game. I fucking run game. And you are full of shit in a different way. I don't even know what that way is, but I'm sure you'll probably make some really shitty art about it. 
guess there's only one right choice, isn't there? You know what? No one cares, you bitch. You know, people hate me. I'm a hateable kind of person. I don't know why, I can't help it. Maybe it's because I have a big ass and good hair. But... I'm gonna get that job. You sure this kind of job you should be having, like being near things that children are near? Yeah, I want something with a touch of innocence. You have a criminal record! You should just drink more. I already feel pretty loose, dangerously loose. Hannah, do you want me to stay sober? Yes. Because you know it's either me or you who's gonna drink that drink. Do you want that on your shoulders? Who's it gonna be? Who's it gonna be? Are Do you, you want serious? that on you? Do you want that on you? No. Oh my God, Relapse City. No. Here it comes, here it comes. No. Call my sponsor. No. Oh shit. Please give this to me. <laughs> You're such a bitch. You're a good friend. Thank you. Sure. What's that you're drinking? Milk. No. This is wild. Put your hands down my pants. Now? Yes. Okay. Like that? Okay. Don't ask me that ever again in my life. Sorry. Listen, the thing to know about Nerva is that we both slept with all the same people. Except, except my father. That was just her. Even if we could be together, even if Hannah didn't exist, that I would destroy you. And you would destroy me. We would destroy each other. You know where this ends up, right? With you in a body bag and me headed to the border pregnant. You know, I kind of look forward to the day that I die. You do not. Get real. I do. If you think about it, time isn't linear. Every moment that's ever happened or that will ever happen is happening right now. We just choose to live in this moment to create some illusion of continuity. So really, we have already died and we've also not yet been born. You think you're such a fucking free spirit because you shacked up with me for two months? I have been living this life for 25 fucking years. I am going to look 50 when I'm 30. Yes, you are. I am going to be so fucking fat like Nico, and you know why? That's because I'm gonna be full of experiences. You know nothing about me. Wisdom comes from experience. And I suspect you've had many, many experiences. Too many, probably, for someone of your age. I've had fun. But it wasn't always fun, was it? <laughs>